She's cut all her hair off. How can we continue filming? Uh, uh, yeah, it's just, it, it's fake. It's, it's fake. so weird. Julie Bowen termed a, a coined a phrase. It's a fob. It's a, a fake fob? bob. It's a it's fake, fake bob. It's a fob. fob. Is it a fob? No, we just made that up. But, I like that. But, but it kind of works. Yeah. Like so. a gentleman. Uh, it's a fob. Claire Danes had a fun way to describe one of the most talked about hairstyles at the Emmys. While Carrie Washington's makeup looks flawless. Join us today as international lead NARS makeup stylist Uzo and red carpet hairstylist Adir shows how you can get those looks at home. Adir, Hello. the fob, is it hard to get? No, there's the fob, there's the lob, there's the bob. <laughs> there's so many things that you can do. So easy. I'm going to show you some Any good tricks. Any length hair can do the fob? Any length hair, any length hair, as long as it's long enough to actually tuck it under. Okay. So the first step you're going to do is you're going to take the underneath hair and you're just going to tease it to create some traction underneath. So super simple. Take the hair, tease it out, brush the top to out. To get some fullness, so fullness in the back. Fullness, and also when you're going to use the pins to tuck it under, you really want to have somewhere to anchor it into. So then you're going to pull the hair into a low ponytail. Okay. Take your rubber band, just put it around your elastic band, just like this. And then the secret is taking your two fingers and rolling it under and then pinning it into place. Cute. So you're going to get any length bob that you really want. So if you want it a little bit longer, you just tuck it a little bit less under. And then you're just going to open it up so it looks like Look how a cute perfect that is. bob, and you can tuck this side behind your ear, and it's gorgeous. It's simple. Just use a little bit of hairspray to finish it off, and then you have the bob. The bob. Yes, and then if you want it a little longer, you make it into a lob. A lob. Yes. Wait, this is. Does it feel secure? Do you feel good? Yeah, it feels really good. This is yeah, she's cute ready to right go. here. A deer flawless. I love All right, in a minute, I'm going to have you see if you can put mine in the fob. Uh, we are going to put it up. Um, let's ready. talk makeup, Uzo. Okay. I loved Carrie Washington. What's the key to getting her look? Because it was so clean and simple looking. It's all about luminous skin first. You want the beautiful backdrop of just pastel colors on the eyes, peach on the cheeks, and a little pinky peach on the lips. Um, what's huge at NARS Cosmetics, our founder and creative director, Francois NARS, says beautiful makeup starts with beautiful skin. You want that beautiful highlighted you got it. To the skin. Got the good skin. <laughs> okay, so we got the good skin. Let's yes. start. What did you do on the eyes? We did a little bit of a lavender um, eyeshadow, and then we finished it off with a darker eggplant along the lash line. But to get that pop, that really thick black lumen lashes that everybody wants, is to actually push a gel liner into the lash line. Wait, say that again. You <laughs> take a gel liner, which is black, and you push it into the base of your lashes to get your lashes to look even fuller. It's a great tip where you don't have to actually use any lash, fake lashes or extra coats of mascara. Oh, neat. Yes. Look at that right there. All right, what about the cheeks? I see some good shimmer yes. on there. So, you know, basically everybody wants that luminous skin, but people don't know how to get it. You want to use a highlighting stick, and I have one right here. Can I show it to you? Yeah, let's quick? do it. We have a beautiful peachy pink champagne shimmer, which you actually add right to the top of the cheekbones. I'm going to move the fob. <laughs> and we're going to like the hair. <laughs> <laughs> what I love about this is that it gives that beautiful luminous texture without looking like it's too dewy. Right now, what we're seeing really on the red carpet is more of a luminous neo matte, which is the new matte, where skin is not too shiny, but it looks like lit from within. That's glowing. Okay, the lips. Now, it's hard to get this color lip to look natural, I think. Okay. So what's the key? Do you line it first? Well, I have a, another tip for you. Uh, tell me, Uzo. We have a multiple product which has, which works like a lip pencil, a lip gloss, and a lipstick all in one. Show me. It's called our Satin Lip Pencil, Biscayne Park, which is actually very similar to the color that Carrie used on the red carpet. And you know, nowadays you want something that's just quick and easy and precise. So you can use this literally to give the lip a little bit more definition. You could use it to fill in. And it has a little bit of a shiny tint texture to it, so it looks like you have a gloss. Mm. And okay. I love the fact that the gloss stays on. I love that all night long. Flawless. Uzo, nice to meet you. Good Thank stuff. You. All right, now come on over, okay, dear. I'm Quickly up, throw the ball about. Hold that. Can we get it up One here? One second. Yes. Here we come. Two Thanks, seconds. Uzo. So, By the way, oh, go ahead. So just to do this, all you're going to do is you're going to take, again, your hair, and okay. you're going to take two fingers, and you're going to tuck this 
under. Yep. And Keep just going, take, Adir. And I'm just going to say uh -uh. something straight ahead. Uh -uh. Dirt, we asked, rising. you answered, ask Billy and I anything that's coming up next. Ask me about my cute hair. You sure this is good on that's me, Adir? It. Yes. Look how cute it's going to look. Should I go one short? More, one more. No, down your short. Just have fun with it. It's so versatile. What do we think?